speaking of Facebook, when they <laughs> launched places, people thought it was the death knell of you guys because yeah. people were already on Facebook. Surely you could check in. Mm -hmm. How worried were you? I would say that was one of the toughest days of the company. Um, when, when, you know, uh, we, Facebook, we were talking a lot with them in 2010 and then, um, and then they announced they're going to launch something in September. And I think it was around the time of the announcement and it was a tech crunch story and everyone in the office was like reading the story and people were kind of second guessing, Oh my God, should we, should we have sold? What, 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 what happened? And, um, I remember I had to, I had to get up in front of everyone in front, in front of like curbed and everyone, cause we all shared office space <laughs> together. And I was like, Foursquare stop reading TechCrunch. Like, the only, like, seriously, don't... This is madness. The only way that we beat these guys and that we own this space is if everyone stops reading the blogs and just builds the stuff that we want to do, right? Build the stuff that we've been talking about all this time, the stuff that's on the whiteboard, and that's... All, like the, we're the only people that are going to build this. There's going to be a ton of people that look at what we're doing and pull apart the pieces that they think are interesting, and they're going to assemble their own Frankenstein version of Foursquare, and we're just going to do the thing that we think we can do well, mm -hmm. which is those SQL statements, which is radar, which is like game mechanics for motivation, merchant tools, and you know, we we built all that stuff. But like having to like rally people at that moment and be like, you know, just cut it out and focus on what you're doing because it's the only way that we get through this like together. I was like, it's a cool moment to look back on. Mm -hmm. And everyone kind of did it and we all rallied around it. We were like 15 people at the time. And you know, we kind of look back at it nostal like nostalgically now. But that was that was tough. Like you know, like we, in the first year, we had everyone trying to kill us, Looped and Gowalla and Scavenger. In the second year, we had, um, you know, we had Facebook and then Google Places. And then, I mean, it's like, it's just, it's just ongoing. And, you know, one of the things that's worked well for us is like, you know, you can, um, and I've had, a, I've had to learn this because I, I've definitely gotten distracted by what other companies are doing and looking at the shiny toys that they make. And I'm like, oh my God, look at that thing. It's so cool. Um, and, you know, we just got to, you got to always look like, like a month ahead right of where you're of where you are now and you just mm -hmm. got to keep running for that and like if you turn around and look at the other guys or turn to the side and look what they're doing you just get distracted when you get distracted you start like thrashing around and when you start thrashing around like everyone becomes dismotive like unmotivated and like you start wasting time and things just get screwed up mm -hmm. and like we've like we've, we've had that happen a bunch of times and mm -hmm. like we're much more disciplined about it now so when you had to stand up and give that speech, like, did you believe what you were saying or were you scared? I, you know, it's a 50, 50, you know, it's, it's like, I mean, it's like, Hey, we made this decision. We got to stick by it. This is what we're going to do. Like, I honestly believe that we could, we could, um, you know, that, that we could make better products than anyone else, but it's tough to compete with companies that are, that are really large like that. Well, the best product doesn't always win. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, it, I, that, that's true, but, um, you know, when you're building the when you're building what you think is the best product, it's like I don't want to live in a world where this doesn't exist. You know, like that's why we ended up building the stuff. You know, taking some of the the dodgeball ideas and rebuilding them. It's like I, I didn't want to do that. I was thinking like, oh, I'll just use these other things that are out there, and these these other guys have figured it out. And I looked at those. This is back in like 2008, and I was like, these these tools aren't good. Like we can build something better than this. Mm -hmm. And it took me a while to get over that hump of like, just build it. Like who cares if it's the same thing? Just build it. 